whenever you use your gift for God, you have a combination, just, okay, you have a combination of feeling on the one hand um, a sense of joy that he used me. But there's another thing you need to understand. There's a feeling, there's a strange sense of emptiness that I just gave out something. Watch this. This is very important to pay attention to when you're in ministry. It's why I understand how somebody can go from the stage to a porn shop. How somebody can go from the stage to a drug usage. How somebody can go from preaching to pornography or to some, some lewd behavior. And we trip when people in ministry and leadership act, are acting out like, like they're much different from us. Let me tell you, let me just break this down to you. Every preacher used to be in the pew. And everybody in the pew used to be in the street. I'm only two steps from the street. Don't get it twisted. <laughs> and you only one step. There you go. Touch that. So, 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 so you, 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 we, 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 we tend to put people on pedestals that they don't deserve to be on. It's just how God has gifted them. But what happens is, here's what you have to understand. People who are very gifted, and I don't even know how this works, Charles. I don't really don't know how it works. I don't know if God more gifts some people than others in certain areas, or they just develop their gift more, or if it's a combination of the two. But some people clearly operate higher in their gift, same gift than other people. But people who are very gifted, watch this, very rarely receive ministry at the level they give it. Mm. Ooh, I just helped somebody. I don't even know where you are. Very rarely do you receive gifting at the level that you give it, which means you're always living in deficit. Mm. That's why you're wandering around trying to feed the vacuity. Mm. Go look that word up. There's a vacuum in you. There's a hollowness. There's an emptiness in you. That, that's a vacuity that you're trying to fill on junk. And so when you finish ministering, you're spent. And so you're looking to have it replaced because you're not getting ministry at the level that you're giving ministry. That's why you can't play around and just go to any church. See, some of y'all understand, I can't just go to any church. I can't just listen to any preacher. I can't just listen to anybody lead worship. I can't just listen to any exhorter. I need ministry at a high level because I give it out at a high level. And I can't afford to walk around hungry and horny. And y'all ain't ready for this today. I can't afford to be wandering around. Somebody say, I need ministry. Don't be asking me to go to Big Mama's church. Don't be asking me to go to Nanny and them church. I ain't going because they pay more over there. I ain't going to pick up that check. I'm too crazy to just go to anybody's church. I got to go somewhere where they could go, where they're going to minister to me at the level I need it. 